Hi, I'm Jen. If you're curious to know how I style overalls or dungarees as some of you in the UK call it, this video is perfect for you. Um, initially, I thought it was pretty hard styling them because I always felt like I came off too juvenile or youthful or kind of like a farmer, but after playing around with a few silhouettes, I think I have nailed the way I personally like to style them, so stay tuned. My first idea is with a crop top, and I like mine to be fitted because overalls come off as slightly shapeless anyway. And my top is from Brandy Melville, and I just love the standard fit of it. I think it works as a perfect foundation because it's neutral enough to complement the statement factor within my overalls. If I had to name this outfit, it'd be Disco Farmer, and the disco would come from the sparkles from my cardigan, and these shoes are kind of reminiscent of like a night out on the town. Down, and the farmer would come with this concho hat which has a, a lot of western appeal to it. My next space is an off-the-shoulder top. When you're wearing something that reveals your shoulders, the look instantly becomes a little bit more sultry and daring. And I got this top from Lulu's. And it was actually a long sleeve top, but I cut the sleeves off to make it into something short for the summer. It's actually a reoccurring problem that happens every summer. I ended up just chopping off the sleeves to all my shirts, which just kind of bites me in the ass when the winter comes back. Anyway, I think that the maturity of the top just tones down the youthful factor of my short dolls. And because I have an unhealthy obsession with hats, I had to add my cap from Style Nanda and I went for some cream converse to make the outfit totally casual and perfect for strutting around during the day. If you don't have a bralette by now, you're seriously missing out because they act as really great bases for a lot of clothing situations. And I like wearing bralettes under long overalls for instances where I want to keep my arms free and uncovered. And I think sometimes it's okay to skip the middleman and just go all out with the bralette because when it's done tastefully, it just looks like you're wearing a camisole. And this paisley overall was actually a little bit too revealing, so I thought the bralette added as a good cover-up. To add more shape to my look, I added my trusty Goodwill belt and then I slipped into my minimalist heels from Zara to keep the look very simple and clean. And yep, I added another hat because it just didn't look right without one. A white button down comes in handy when you want to dress up a pair of overalls. Anything with a collar just instantly adds structure and formality to an outfit. And plus, I think they just look incredible with overalls. And I really like this particular style because of the way it button downs just like a shirt instead of just having like those clasps on the side. And I'm wearing my Jeffrey Campbell Gladiators to keep up with the summer theme of my outfits. This next look is just a really fancy evening look featuring overalls and I wanted to include this because I'm really happy with the way I styled it. These pair of overalls were actually just way too big on me. The straps were ridiculously long so I just tied them around my neck to make it into a sexy halter. And since the waist wasn't connected to the straps, I added a thick studded belt to hold the outfit together and I added a zodiac bracelet that I turned into an armlet by pushing it up on my arm. And then I wore my black pumps from Marshalls to take this evening look to the next level. So that was how I style overalls or dungarees. Please comment down below and let me know what your favorite outfit was or tell me how you style them because I think it would be a really good place to bounce off ideas on how 
to style this difficult pair of clothing. My Instagram is I'm Jen M. If you want to show me how you style overalls or dungarees, you should use the hashtag I'm Jen M or Clothes Encounters, whatever you prefer. I just know that if you do the at sign, I am not going to find it because it just gets flooded with the amount of notifications I get. So if you hashtag it, then I'll definitely see it and I'll like it and maybe I'll leave a comment back. Alright, so I'll see you in my next one. Bye! Hi, it's Jen. Happy Saturday. I'm here because I have some really amazing news to share with you. I've been accepted to Bullseye University, which is Target's 24-hour live streaming dorm. And so for four days, you're going to see people like me there 24-7. And you can see it at bullseyeuniversity.com. It starts on Monday, July 15th, 6 a.m. Pacific, and so that's 9 a.m. Eastern. And so at this event, you're going to see us do a lot of live things like I'll be doing college advice, hairstyle tricks, makeup even. So if you have any questions about college, like how to balance your social life and your studies or making friends or my favorite college hairstyles, then please comment down below and I'll pick my favorite and I'll answer them for you at Bullseye University. Also, I'll be doing caricatures and a caricature is basically a really exaggerated cartoon of you. So if you want me to draw you go on Instagram hashtag I'm Jen M or hashtag close encounters of your favorite selfie and I just might draw you there there's gonna be over 400 prizes that we're gonna give away so the more you hang out the more likely you're gonna win something if you're interested but you know you're a really forgetful person you can sign up for a reminder at bullseyeuniversity.com and yeah I hope to see you guys on Monday bye